welcome back. So today we're just going to do some so different type rigs for different cats, rivers, lakes. So we'll start off with just a basic Carolina rig. One of the easier ones to tie. Which I like using circle hooks. But you can use any kind of hooks you want. So I like to snail knot them. Go in the high eye towards your hook. I use the no knot snail. Basically it's easy. Just have your tagline down there. Wrap it six to seven times. Just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do an extra one, eight. Then you're going to take your other end, run it back through the back of the hook. Pull it tight. So you're going to cut your tag line off. On Carolina rays is going to be the hook, leader line to the swivel. So there it is. Just your swivel, leader line to your hook. And I like to put in these insulators. Put it in. And just wrap it. That way, if you're out fishing, you break off, it's already tied, pop it off, tie it on. Alright, so next one I like to use for flatheads. Same thing, get your leader line. So you're going to use the same thing as a hook. Like I said, I use a no knot. You can use whatever knot you like, but with circle hooks, the snail knot is the best. So in this one, we're going to throw a bead on it. That just helps protect the knot a little bit. I'm going to do a little rattle in there. If you want, you can actually just throw another rattler on there. Just to get a little more vibration noise. So anyway, rivers and current. This is that vibration in the water. Let's get those flatheads moving. And we'll go ahead and tie a leader on, or swivel. So you go ahead, tie swivel on. Tight. Okay, tag line off. I'm going to put that one on our tube. All this is just your pipe insulation. You get from Lowe's, I don't know, a couple dollars, a couple bucks. So next one we're going to do is the Santia rig, which I already got video on this one, so I'm going to go through it quick. Like I said, the Santia rig. Same thing. Hook it on. So if you made it this far in the video, comment below on what your favorite catfish rig is. 
or comment on what rig you want me to tie up for the next video. And when you do, I'll pick one random person out of the comments. They have to be a subscriber. I will send them two bait towels like this. All right, so we got one of the beads. So we'll go one more for this video. We'll do the kitty calls. So probably want about two foot a liter. So these are the kitty calls from Trophy Cat. You can see, very loud. Nice river current. Get moving. So what I like to do is time head down first. Now I don't like to tie them separate knots. So I don't actually cut my line to do them. So however far you want it, just like that. And for the most part, they'll stay, but if you want, just put, go ahead, just put a piece of tape right there and hold it in there at place or however, wherever you want it. So we'll go ahead and tie a swivel on. So there's that rig. So the only reason I tie the head down, face and the hook, I'm a bank fisherman, so when you cast them, they cast better. More aerodynamic. Just can't get over the sound of that. It's loud. So any videos in the future you want me to see, record, let me know. Either how-to videos. I know season, uh, catfish is going to be starting to hit really good here in Ohio. So I'll be doing more fishing videos next few weeks I know we got a trout fishing video coming up um, you guys want to see in the videos comment below let me know also still if you want these towels message me Either you can win them on this video or you can buy them Thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, hit the subscribe button. Till next time. Peace.